Yeah, Yamato's, Yamato's photo. Ew. What is that from Smiling Friends, yo? Yo. Not kill, not confirm, counter, 11. That should also be a negative. Hold on. No, this is crazy. We being too soft on kid. You know what? There's an agenda. He must be a kid fan. Oh, I need this. Oh, look at this meme. It's here. Oh, X Drake Slander. Come on. Give me. Yo, I need this. I need this. I need this. We have Wano part two of the report cards. You guys asked for a part two. We listened to the chat. Not a fraud listening to you guys and pumped out part two. So last time, a lot of y'all weren't happy with Odin's ratings, but I'm pretty sure with the other pirates that we haven't covered, the other people we haven't covered, there should be some people that get in these negative scores too, but I don't know. So let's find out if you guys are not familiar with the report cards, obviously go back and watch the other ones. We've done Wano part one. We have done um, an initial egghead one and we've done a Marine Ford one. Marine Ford one is hilarious and the egghead one is hilarious but here we are with wano part two with much more to come and we're starting off with trafalgar law law versus hawkins clash with no conclusion we got a simple zero that's cool spends most of the chapter being unable to get his alliance under control plans fall apart and his cover is blown that is an l partially to luffy but it is an l pirates doing nice things for people makes me sick then admits to stealing <laughs> stealing safe and healthy food from a farm in a starving country <laughs> yo that's crazy that's crazy but it's true he's a poser hawkins prevents him from teleporting luffy to safety forced to flee due to sea stone nails yo that's funny that's funny that's law standard okay so we're, we got a little bit of lost lander here under his edge lord facade is a huge nerd knows too much about german 66 caught him off of that but again that's a zero sorry excuse of a crew is held hostage by hawkins i ain't gonna lie consider how hawkins went out yeah yeah that's that's an l captured by hawkins rest of the crew escapes another l dismantles hawkins off screen so he just makes up for it you love to see it he did dismantle hawkins off screen i don't know if y'all remember that i don't know if you remember the panel but hawkins got dismantled off screen destroy some ships with kid and luffy okay little w wets pants at the thought of ups man joining the straw hats if you all know who ups man is it's obviously jim Bay. takes out guards and checks out some poneglyphs okay regular then we got roof piece hurl some rocks at kaido expecting it to do any damage i mean it's an l but i thought they were hockey rocks so he should get some he should get some love for the hockey rocks gamma knife against kaido does not turn damage cold save zoro who was about to die from a combined yako attack thank you for saying that because a lot of people just say yeah zoro blocked the whole attack no zoro was going to die that's it it wouldn't have been a block he just held it for a couple of seconds combo attack with kid killer zoro knocks big mom off the rooftop cold eats a thunder bagua is still conscious and very mobile unlike luffy in act one he still got an l for it i don't know i feel like i mean he did get thunder bagua off but he also kind of took it and i think he should be given credit for taking it personally I don't know if I agree with that, but this is this is the agenda report cards. You know, it is what it is. Personally, I don't agree with it, but hey, it is what it is. You guys can complain a lot about these report cards, but if there's one thing this report card is consistent on, there's a lot of things that we may not agree with, but it's about the agenda. So it is what it is. Counter shocks, big mom, counter shocks, big mom immediately gets hit with stolen fire attack, neutral. Devil Fruit Awakening, combo attack against big mom, finally does good damage, cold. Takes off screen damage throughout the fight against big mom. <laughs> Yo, we just, we just nitpicking at this point. Another effective awakened combo attack against Big Mom. Nice. Punctures Big Mom with his willy. Ah! What? Does crazy damage while taking multiple close range punches. Defeats a Yanko with Kid W. Unknowingly takes care of Kanjiro Blobblobum by sending Big Mom through the floor and into bombs. I love how Law's getting a W from that. I love that. That's Mickey, but we take those. Gets a 3 billion berry bounty. Definitely overinflated, but we'll give it to him. Cold. Learns of the road Poneglyphs and Old Wano. Okay, true, true. Orchestrated the majority of the plans and the raid in Odegashima while babysitting a bunch of children. Greed carried kid in the fight against Big Mom. Thank you. Get those extra points to law. Plus six, backbone of the raid. <laughs> Yo, wait. he got those nails on. What's wrong with him? Yo, what would you put that on his <laughs> Yo, but anyway, shout out to law. Well deserved. Law was fantastic. Law was great. Oh, here we go, chat. Y'all ready? Chat. Y'all know who's up next. Houston's kid. Oh, okay. 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 It's time. It's time. It's time. Please. Come on. Give me this kid slander. Conqueror's hockey confirmed is never used. I don't know, man. That's an L to me. I don't like it. That shouldn't be green. We giving him a W for something he never used. They confirmed it, but he ain't never used it. What's the point of having it? What's the point? You know what? It is what it is. Like I told y'all, we not all going to agree with it. Doesn't mean I'm going to. I didn't make them. I'm just saying. Competes, beats up, beats up guard with Luffy. Supposed to imply the arrival is this ages poorly. It really does. Players, he will be one he will be the one who gets famous from beating kaido this age is poorly <laughs> somehow manages to escape unam by himself i don't know how he did that um gets caught again
again, though it's implied he let himself because of Killer. Fair. Tortured by drowning until he and Killer are saved by Luffy. I mean, and L's an L. Destroys ships with Law and Luffy. Okay. Like Law, wets himself at the thought of UPS man joining the Straw Hats. Same. Slams a poo into a wall with Punk Gibson. Casually eats a poo's attack that Lil Dim Zoro and a poo. <laughs> Lil Dim Zoro and Luffy and calls a poo trash. You know what's funny? He did do that. Roof piece. Damn, you can actually damage Kaido with physical blows? This should be Crimson Red. This should be Crimson Red, because that's his main fighting style. So if you don't even know that, that should be Crimson Red. That should be negative two, not negative one. I don't agree with that. That's a negative two. Slams Kaido like it's like it's the WWE. Kaido pretended to be hurt so Kid wouldn't be sad. That should also be a negative. Hold on. No, this is crazy. We being too soft on Kid. You know what? There's an agenda. He must be a Kid fan. That's what it is. We be soft on it. Combo attack with Killer, Law, and Zoro knocks Big Mom off the rooftop. That's fair. Changes target to Big Mom, then gets hit with a full a full Gura. Negative one. Okay. Slams Big Mom into the floor with Punk Gibson, saving Nami, Usab, and Tama. W. Yeah. Takes damage from both Big Mom and the Killer versus Hawkins fight. Okay. Devil Fruit awakens combo attack against Big Mom. Finally does good damage. Law carried, but a W is a W, I guess. Takes off-screen damage. Same thing with Law. Another effective awaken combo attack. Okay. Same thing as Law. Big Mom says Law's attacks are dangerous immediately after taking Kid's attacks. You see, how we getting the negative two? But the negative two should have been up here too. The negative two should have been up here. I'm gonna dispute this. I'm disputing this. Yeah, Kid Stan, I know it. Takes Misery attack is still standing. Okay, unleashes a damned punk. Finally gets a cool attack. Agreed. Defeats a Yonka with Law. I can't dispute that. Only takes care of Conjuro bra problem with Law. I guess if we give it to Law, fine. Acts neutrally towards a poo after the raid. That should be a negative two because that's not in his character. So I'm disappointed in that. Gets a three billion berry bounty. Definitely overinflated, but we'll give it to him. Eh. Drops lore about a man with a burn scar. Eh. All right. Actually took a crazy amount of damage throughout the raid. Underrated durability. I'm not going to discount that. Even though I even though I, did, I I dislike Kid and I think he's trash, that's fine. Extra deduction, rooftop LVP, dealt the least amount of damage to either Yonko. Should be, that should be Crimson Red, but okay. Needs Law Assist to do any real damage against Big Mom. Okay. Horrendous uses of magnet powers with the exception of Damned Punk. Again, another dark one. Okay. With no explanation at all, let's Luffy call dibs on beating Kaido and changes targets to Big Mom is dead. Plus one, underwhelming. This should be a negative four. At least, at the bare minimum, this should be a negative four. This should be a negative four. I disagree. I disagree. I disagree. I disagree. I ain't gonna lie. This, this is bias. Not a fraud. I'm onto you, all right? You say you're not a fraud. You might just be a fraud. He's a closet kid stand. For all you people out here that was mad about older and just look at this look what i'm dealing with if you gotta deal with it i gotta deal with it too it is what it is Dio might have made this list this is unreal this is unreal somebody you know what i figured it out i figured it out strong man's right kid fan bribed him a kid fan a kid fan bribed him i know it there was a kid fan out there that bribed him that's what it is this is we're talking about bribes here all right he said this is appalling it's gotta be bro <laughs> up next we've got killer so killer escapes the mental asylum asylum starts fighting zoro okay stabs zoro eventually knocking him unconscious cold extra deduction needed the bridge bandit to distract zoro okay i suppose scythe is stolen and it and is used against him gets taken out before zoro passes out okay negative two gets him and his caption captured in prison revealed to be a smile fruit victim tortured by by drowning until he kid and till he and kid are saved by luffy all right it keeps luffy and zoro from eating more of Apu's attacks. Yeah, yeah, okay. So he does that by merely covering their ears. No, okay. Combo attack with Zoro against Kaido. No damage. Sound Scythe attack does more damage to Kaido than Kid does the entire rooftop fight. Definitely a big W. I don't know why Kid didn't get docked more, but all right. Hit by Big Mom's injury attack. Okay. Combo attack with Kid Law. Zoro knocks him out. Okay. Goes after Big Mom with Kid after gets hit. Yeah. Goes after Big Mom with Kid gets hit with Fulgara. Okay. Fulgura. Fulgura. Tax Hawkins unknowingly hurting his own captain i mean that should be he couldn't help that right of course he couldn't help that i don't feel like you're being a little harsh but all right freeze kid from hawkins double fruit power by cutting off hawkins left arm kid has no left arm cold in a separate attack takes out hawkins nice vice captain energy green double green agreed had to babysit kid and zoro a bunch will live the rest of his life laughing mostly because a reindeer quack doctor didn't do his job in curing smile i agree with that although i'm not going i don't know if i'm gonna give him a, an l for that one i, I totally replaced him with sanji on the roof top in that one promo art for the wano climax oh this is petty look at this oh no this is petty this is petty how are you gonna give killer a negative one and give kid a plus one how are we gonna do this nah this is bias this is it you know what bro yo this is yo we got controversy we got controversy in part two we got controversy in part two we got some controversy here we need to do an investigation where's the f you know what 
I want the FIA on this case. I am demanding the FIA get on this case right now. I'm demanding it. The FIA, justice for killer. There's some, there's a scandal going on and we need the FIA. We need the fraud investigation you, uh, agency on it, bro. I'm telling you, we need the FIA. Fraud is hilarious though, I ain't gonna lie. Fa, 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 fraud. That's, that's actually funny. Justice for killer. Yo, look at this one. <laughs> I hate this meme so much. Look at King Dog. Yo, let's read this. Let's read this because it looks like King got bullied, bro. Hold on. Kicks big mom pirates down the waterfall. W. Can't detect Sanji. Momo is rescued. Trans observation. Aki cold. It's solid attack off on Sanji. True. Uh, shitty teamwork with Queen and can barely 2v1 Marco. True. Finally shows a fiber of teamwork can push back against 2 HP Marco and a pre-awakened San pre Sanji. Sanji is crazy. Eats combo attack from Zoro and Sanji. Little to no damage. True. Had a hasty fit because Zoro cut off a piece of his mask. Got very aggressive. Yeah, he's a little sensitive there. Um, overwhelmed Zoro the entire chapter. True. Baits and blows Zoro up. Laser attack does significant damage. True. Miscalculation. Failed to conceal that he was black under the mask, giving Zoro the power up he needed. Yo, that's crazy. Took out allies because they saw his face cold. He cut them out. Miscalculation is crazy. Back and forth with Zoro. Both takes and deals damage. Okay. Loses to an edgelord who gave himself the title king. <laughs> Gets low diffed by Green Bull. Had seven days to rest in the hill, which is a lot in one piece time. True. Thought his sad boy captain could be Joy Boy. Extra deduction. Extra deduction. Had no reason to turn off his flames against Zoro. He was fully aware Zoro had figured out his fighting gimmick. Negative six. Dumbass. I didn't even think about that, yo. Yo, I didn't even think about he had no reason to turn his flames off. We could have just waited. Yo, oh my god. Nah, that's funny. I ain't gonna lie, that's funny. That picture is toxic, bro. This picture is so toxic. <laughs> Look at so <laughs> Alright, it's time, bro. Oh, we got Queen. Here we go, bro. Here we go. Queen pulls up on Udon and toys uh, and toys with the prisoners. Makes Luffy play sumo game for sport with collar around his neck. Multiple characters. Okay. Neutral. Talk shoot. Gets body by Big Mom. True. Brachio Bomber does enough damage to undo Big Mom's dementia and knock her out. Takes her to Kaido. W. Can't detect Sanji Momo's rescue. Trans observation Aki. Agreed. Catches Luffy and Zoro with his bite. Prevents them from reaching the roof. Okay, W. Spreads the ice virus. Takes out allies and creates one of the arc's most subplots. One of the arc's worst subplots. Agreed. Trash teamwork with King and can barely 2v1 Marco, of course. Gets bitch slapped by Chopper. L. It's a nasty attack from Sanji who's carrying dead weight. That's wild. Remains unfocused and eats a cold earlier strike from Sanji. That's fine. Finally shows a fiber of teamwork can push back against an exhausted Marco and pre-awakened Sanji. Same thing as King. It's a combo attack from Zoro and Sanji. Same thing. Goofy ass attack catches everyone off guard. Crushes Sanji. Minor W. Blows himself up with his own rocket. Proceeds to do zero damage with crushing attack and sword attack. That is an L and I remember that as well. Taunts and gaslights Sanji into thinking he hit a woman. This was fairly effective. Got a W. You gaslight. Hit with Hell's memories. L. Uses San uses Vince Smoke's powers to overwhelm Sanji. Okay. Lost focus again. Bro needs <laughs> bro needs a roll. Loses the fight and is sent flying off the island. Gets low diffed by Green Bull seven days. Same thing as King. True. Additional points. Fairly entertaining villain, at least compared to Kaido's other officer. True. Managed to get rejected by a prostitute. Negative seven incel. Oh, that's crazy, bro. I ain't gonna lie. That last one is that last one's crazy. But it's true. Next we got Alti. Alti should have a good score. We just saw that, obviously, but Alti should have a good score. Alti slanders Kaido during her induction. Cold. Almost pushes Luffy to gear four. True. True. Almost knocked out by Yamato's Thunder Bakwa. <laughs> I guess an L's an L. Slanders Yamato is just as annoyed by their antics as we are. Cold. Truth. Pretends she needed to be saved by page one from Usopp's attack. Okay, that's neutral. Decimates Nami and cracks Usopp's skull. Almost gets her gets her to say that their captain will be king. Cold. Loki got Usopp to admit he would have said it if <laughs> he would have said it to save his own ass. We do need to slander Usopp for that, so I love that. Gets rocked by Nami's Thunder Lance tempo. That's an L. Doesn't hesitate to attack Big Mom. Takes out Komachio, the lion dog thing. I'm glad she got rid of that dog. That dog was annoying. Lion dog or whatever that thing was. Uses hybrid form to attack a defenseless eight-year-old. Gets attacked by Nami for it. That is an L. Takes big damage from Big Mom. Is out momentarily. I mean, it's an L, but she did get back up, so I respect that. One last attempt to attack Tama is fully taken out by Nami, Mosley, and Usopp. True. That is an L. So that's negative five. Oh, that's crazy. Only somewhat competent Toby Robo. The bar was set low. True. Hard carries page one throughout the fight. That's also true. Was an absolute tank. It took combined efforts of Yamato, Nami, Usopp, and Big Mom to take her down for good also a w agreed on some alabama type shit with page one 
<laughs> yeah, 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 the, yeah. It was a little, it was a little, yeah. An uncanny number of people really thought this for a while. That's true. Basically, a lot of people were shipping page one and an ulti together. Yeah. <laughs> you just getting the L for that alone? Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Roll tie. Plus two carries the Toby Ropo. Stand proud. You are strong. What does this mean? I just, someone explain this to me. Oh, I know, I know where it's from. I'm wondering why it's Katakuri there. Are we slandering Katakuri? Wait, ulti solos Katakuri? That's, oh, that's hideous. That's hideous. That's hideous. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, 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 sorry. I misread it. I misread it. There's a dis deduction for ulti. An uncanny number of people really thought this for a while. That ulti would... Okay, I get it. 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 I, I get it now. I get it. Marco. Well, I'm curious. To, I'm curious to see what he has for this Marco one. Marco knocks down the big mom pirates. Knocks the big mom pirates down the waterfall. In an attempt to figure out his role, makes an alliance with Peril Sparrow that lasts for five minutes and nearly backfires. Clashes with big mom and does the same damage due to the nature of his blue flames and does some... Okay, true. True. Gets choked by Big Mom. Must be saved by Wanda and Carrot, who attack Peril Sparrow. True. Helps stall the ice virus effects with blue flames. Cold. Sends Zoro to the roof, avoiding attacks from King and Queen. That was cold. Stalls both King and Queen for a few chapters. Cold. Blocks King's attack in order to save medical group who's carrying Zoro. He did a lot of saving. He did a lot of saving. It's time for the stars to take the stage. Barely does anything for the rest of the art question mark. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Blocks a blast breath from Kaido, saving Nami and Tama. True. He, he, did, he did a ton of stalling. Felt much less impressive than he did in Marineford, which is true. Um, 1.3 billion Barry Man didn't take anyone out other than fodder and was reduced to being Chopper's assistant. I just, I, I love the extra slander here. <laughs> Plus two, washed but still useful. Marco, go stall one oh. Yo, we should have meet stall man. I love it, bro. This is basically meet stall man. That's it, bro. He's only one above kid. Yo. Next, we got a poo. Next, we got a poo. Um, briefly knocks out Luffy and slices Zoro with seemingly zero difficulty that was a w for a poo 980 i remember that gets slammed by kids attack gets slandered when trying to counter attack true attack is nullified by simply covering one's ears this is incredibly lame yes i ain't gonna lie yeah. Runs around with the ice virus antidote for a while. Somewhat holds off Zoro, Drake, and the fodder who are all trying to take him out. Gets cut down by Zoro while fending off X Drake. True. Fights X Drake, then teams up, constantly switching sides. Yeah, Pooh was contract. Nearly taken out by a mere CP0 agent. True. Abandons temporary alliance with Drake because they were getting low diff by CP0 agents. True. Beast with a number giant. <laughs> Neutral. Somehow neutralizes his his beef with kids. Seriously, how did he do that? I agree. Oh my god. With varying degrees of success is very opportunistic when he switches sides like <laughs> with rat like behavior i would expect from a real pirate yeah honestly yes he is a true rat comment not having an encounter with brooke was a crime i agreed no minus to a coral zone victim yeah coral zone would off screen a poop coral zone would off screen a poop yeah i need this one. I, oh, i need this oh look at this meme it's here oh x drake slander come on give me yo i need this i need this i need this x drake gets one attack in on sanji revealed to be a toby ropo gets bodied by queen and who's who forced to switch alliances true um combo attack with luffy against one of the numbers that's it teams up with zoro against the poo kill is stolen by zoro chomps down on 2 hp a poo this does not take out a poo 2 hp a poo it's taken out by the same cp0 agent twice <laughs> we're at the end of egghead and bro is still in the hospital another l i agree i have comments i have so little to say about this character he's pretty boring weaker than i thought he was going to be basically just became another number for the alliance and is part of sword i guess negative three overall uh what does he even do <laughs> What does he do, bro? He's so washed, bro. Drake is washed. So Hawkins is coming up next, and I see it. He's coming up next. I need... Hawkins got to get fried. I need Hawkins to get cooked. He's got to get cooked. He's got to get cooked. Oh, I see it already. All right, let's go. Let's lock in. Let's lock in. Manages to damage Zoro with nails. Transfers damage from Zoro's counterattack to a random beast pirate. Okay, W. Law versus Hawkins. Even clash. Hawkins confirms his suspicion of the alliance. Hawkins forces Law to flee instead of saving Luffy. W. Holds Law's bum crew hostage. W. Successfully captures Law. True. Off screened by law. Reveals he took the coward's way out instead of fighting Kaido. But massive L. Fights dirty against Killer. They're pirates after all. Fair. W. Loses to Killer with the most obvious counter to his power. Kid not having an arm was something we all saw coming. Last the lamest death imaginable. He was the 1% the whole time. This should be as crimson red as possible. That's hilarious, bro. That's hilarious. I see. I see. I see the note, Jacko. Um, extra deduction. Unwilling to go against the odds. Negative or 
cold. Oda only killed him to artificially inflate the attention of the arc. Negative four, worst supernova. By far, he's the worst supernova. He is definitely the worst supernova. And I, I'm just saying that we have extra pages. There you go. I've seen him. So we got extra pages. <laughs> Yeah, Yamato's, Yamato's photo. <laughs> what? What is he? <laughs> okay, let me just take a brief. Let me take a deep breath. I, I saw it too, Chad. Trust me. So, yo, I need to get my composure. I need to get my composure, dog. Yamato attacks Alti, saves Luffy from the embarrassment of Gear Fourth for Toby Robo True. Reveals identity and connection to Ace. Neutral. Rescued from exploding cuffs. Beast with Alti. Confirms to be switching sides. Okay. All neutral. Ugh. Tries to convince a child whose father is super dead that they're Odin. Yeah, that was an L. I ain't gonna lie. That was a crazy L. Continues to chase the confused child, fearing for his life. Another L. Yes, I agree. I was so turned off by that, bro. I was so upset about that um protects momo and shinobu gives a much less confusing introduction to them true casually takes out a number giant clash with pre-time skip ace the only form of ace i suppose true darts lore drop and makes ace's vivri card true wants to hide momo under their clothes nearly exposing boobs to an ah! eight-year-old that's a crazy gaslight, but also true. Continues to <laughs> continues streak of fraud in meat riding. True. Even blast breath clash with Kaido. Confirmed to have Conqueror's hockey as a child. Did more damage to Kaido in the Thunder Bagua clash. Cold. Combo attack against Kaido with Luffy. Cold. Chases the Conjuro Blob for a while. That is neutral, but that was annoying. Can't take out the Conjuro Blob with ice powers. Needs Big Mom to accidentally set off the bombs. True, that is an L. Helps Momonosuke discover his flame cloud powers, saving the entire island. Multiple chapters. W. Gets one attack in on Green Bull is reduced to fan service for the rest of the encounter. Teases from multiple chapters that they're joining the crew only to do the opposite with the dumbest excuse imaginable. Oh, that was so bad, dog. The community was so pissed. The community was so pissed. That is definitely a negative. That's a negative. Doesn't tell us anything about Odin's journal that we didn't already know from the Odin flashback. Most of y'all only like Yamato for the side boobs. Please go outside. Oh, he got. They coming at. They coming at all of. Yo, turned the fandom braid dead for months with the identity discourse didn't even join the crew negative four wasted everybody's time spitting he cooked he cooked so hard yamato is the biggest waste of time we have ever experienced in one piece bro cold he turned the fandom brain dead for with identity discourse and didn't even join the crew bro oh my god cook that was terrible that was a terrible time for the community bro didn't with this Yamato nonsense was the worst time the community has ever had, bro. Oh God, I love it. Oh, it's time. Knock down a waterfall by a giant uh, by a giant bird in a gimp outfit. Washes up on a random show with amnesia gets manipulated by a quack doctor. Yes, an L. Slams Queen into the ground, then shoulder throws him, briefly knocks him out, punches Luffy away in his failed advanced Conqueror's hockey uh, Conqueror's hockey attempt. Cold. Regains her senses after Queen headbutts her, passes out, then is taken to Kaido. L. Gets released from chains and fights Kaido with a sky split. Cold. Forms an alliance with Kaido. Yep. Gets run over by Frankie Brook. Gets slandered by Frankie. Yes, that's an L. Gets thrown by Jinbei and rolled off a ledge by Robin. Another L. Takes damage from Marco's flames, chokes him out. I remember that. Roof piece. Hits everyone with a lightning attack in one sequence luffy not affected that was cold combo attack with kaido is momentarily blocked by zoro still does crazy damage agreed gets comboed by zoro law and kid and is knocked off the island hits kid with new lightning attack fulgura right okay here we are mothering mode agreed negative heavy negative mothering mode was trash saves tama by taking out page one with advanced conqueror's hockey attack Never to be seen again. Momentarily takes out Alti. It's her own alliance, but we'll give her something true. Slammed to the floor by Kid. Remember that, SNL. Clobbered by Kid and Law's Awakening. Uses a year of her own life to heal. True. Takes multiple combo attacks from Kid and Law. L. Only slanders Kid by calling Law's attack dangerous and ignoring his. W. Strongest known attack, Misery. Can't take out an exhausted Kid. Can't take out Law with a multiple, the multi point blank punches. Can't instill fear into either Kid or Law. Loses the fight, then cries about it being Roger's 
salty. Yo, doesn't use advanced conquerors hockey in the kid and law fight. Hey, hey, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. I didn't even think about that till just now. I didn't even think about that till just now. Hey, just forgot about her crew and children after the waterfall incident. Absolutely. She never had advanced conquerors hockey. She used it on page one. She one shot page one. Oh, she got it. We know she got it. Whole Cake Island gets attacked by Blackbeard because she left and took half of her crew with her. <laughs> Negative 12. A lost her whole cake island over. Ew. What? Is that from Smiling Friends, yo? Yo. Oh, my God. Oh, that's hideous. That's hideous, bro. It's time. Here we go, bro. We're here with Kaido. We've been waiting for this one. It's time, bro. We've been, we've been waiting for Kaido. We've been waiting for Kaido, bro. Kaido, page one. Blows up Odin's castle. Eats multiple punches from Luffy. Little to no damage. True. One shots Luffy. Major. Willingly takes off Big Mom Sea Stone Cuffs in order to fight her. Splits the sky cold. Forms an alliance with Big Mom. Oh, uh, I would say that's a W. Forming an alliance with Big Mom, but we'll see. Odin flashback. Took over Wano while Odin was was gone slaughtered gecko mori and his crew w had crazy prep time due to having a secret informant still gets a giant scar and has to rely on an old lady to beat odin crazy prep time is crazy and he still gets a scar kills odin with a pistol neutral throws momo into a burning building and instead of killing him kill not confirmed counter one yo about this thing he could have just killed momo and instead he throws him in a building what's off orochi's head kill not confirmed counter two Rushed by nine scabbards, takes damage because of Odin PTSD. Takes multiple attacks from the scabbards, including a store brand Paradise Totsuka. Tells the scabbards they're washed and cuts off the arm of Zoro's girl. That's crazy. Goes back into base form, takes out each scabbard one by one. Very disrespectful. That is crazy. Going into base and taking out everybody one by one as well. Lifts an entire island into the sky with double fruit powers, neutral. Although I feel like that should be a green, but it is what it is. Every single scabbard is still breathing. Not kill, not confirm the counter. 11. It's a red rock. First time taking significant damage. Forced to drop top five. Wind blade breath attack misses everyone. Supernovas all get a shot. Okay, okay. It's more odor PTSD from Enma. Must be told to dodge the attack. Yeah. Yo, yo, it's only getting worse. It's only getting worse, bro. Combo attack with Big Mom is blocked by Zoro. Still nearly kills him. Momentarily knocks out Luffy after he tried talking shit. Momentarily gets overpowered by a half-dead Zoro. Receives a new paper's cut scar. Oh, Thunder Pogba, Zoro, and Law in one swift motion. Cold. Gets rushed by Luffy after he discovers advanced conquerors hockey. Cold. Off screens Luffy and throws him off the rooftop. Kill not confirmed number 12. Destroys Kitty Mom with an advanced conquerors hockey attack. Attack, then stabs him. Kenny ah! is still alive. Kill not confirmed counter 13. 13 unconfirmed kills. Yo. Took more damage from Thunder Bagua Clash than Yamato did. It takes bite damage from an A. Bro, I'll be telling y'all, kind of was screaming for no reason, dog. Like, yo, oh my god. He was screaming for what reason, dog? Like, bite damage. Oh. Clash with Luffy splits the skies. Goes through stages of drunk. Goes through stages of drunk while fighting Luffy. Had future sight the whole time. Green. Kills Luffy, but it's a repeat of what happened with Odin. Killed not confirmed counter 14. And that's just page one. Page two. Attacks Giranika for inner fearing but doesn't kill him Odin confirmed at SBS that Giranika took the photo of Giranika kill not confirmed 50 it's jump roped by giant Luffy knocks Luffy out of gear 5 yaps a hockey transcending oh, devil fruit hybrid fool <laughs> 200 IQ play. Take the barrage gun head on. He loses. Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh, extra points. Still never lost a true 1v1. They took the combined efforts of five supernova, nine scabbards, Yamato, and adult Momonosuke to take him out. W. Multiple suicide attempts. Not one where he tried jumping into seawater. Extra deduction. Garbage backstory. Extra deduction. World's strongest creature. Not world's strongest man. Ambiguous title is probably more fraudulent than fraud hogs. 15 unconfirmed kills that heavily contributed to his downfall. All zero bodies except for him. 
flashback. <laughs> Negative 13, Crido King of Elves. <laughs> 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 oh my goodness oh my god that is funny oh that was funny that was worth it oh my god i don't know this might be i might have laughed the most of these report cards i ain't gonna lie this is funny this was funny bro oh my god you said we're missing one what about jack it is what it is we don't need jack bro i think we're good i got everything i need <laughs> yeah don't jump on it man he's just asking a question leave him alone dog yeah leave phoenix alone yo leave him alone <laughs> all right i'm done with it i'm done recording this video bro oh my god more report cards to come man like comment and subscribe and don't forget to watch the other report card videos i'll probably have a playlist in the video somewhere be sure to check them out